Good morning! Wake up! Good morning, Comey. It's as if he worked at a hotel growing up. Tucked off in the duck off. Oh my god, I'm so, so humble. humble. Like a vibrator. They say this is a big rich town. I just come from the poorest part. I never took a straight path nowhere. Life full of twists and turns, bumps and bruises. I live, I learn. I'm from that city full of yellow cabs and skyscrapers. It's hard to get a start, you sparse without paper. Homie, I grew up in hell. A block away from heaven. That corner is 16. I gotta make it. This is where it goes down. Oh, yeah. I just need to come up home. Woo! What are you doing here right now? Huh? Hey, Comies! Good morning! <sighs> what? I'm sleep. So what? Yo, check this out. Today, guys, we're about to go through our morning routine. You wanna do it? Nice. Wake up! <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. I'm the perky one. I'm up early. Lots of energy. Funky! <laughs> yeah. Good morning, babe. Good morning. Wow, nice bonnet. Thank you, Isn't your body supposed to be on your head? Yeah. Hey, Comey. Ooh. Stop! Ooh. Stop! Wow. I'm talking about some, hey, Comey's. <laughs> oh my God. It's not even like that. Don't wow. Hey, Comey. Where you get the head? First of all. You need to go brush your teeth. You brush to that go. tongue. You need to go brush. You brush your tongue. Okay. It's probably white. Stupid. Good morning, Comey. Good morning. Get on your hands and knees. Get on my hands and knees. Hey, man. Every morning, I just gotta hit the floor, get on my knees. Thank God. It's a routine, man. That's how I get my day started, so. Yeah. I just meditate and pray and say thank you to God like this. Sleep. No, I'm not sleep. I do 10 seconds of breathing in and out. No thinking of anything else, just freeing my mind. You be going back to sleep. Like this. She be going back to sleep. She gonna come out the room for another two hours. And then I get up, let's go. Okay, first things first, let's make this bed. Omar is a pro bed maker. Uh, it's as if he worked at a hotel growing up. I. It's as if Candace never made bed at all growing up. How about that, okay? He taught me how to do I mean, I did do my bed growing up. It just wasn't like OCD perfectionist like the way yeah, he make is. make it nice and neat, man. This looks fine to me. It doesn't have to be too perky, but it just has to be good enough so that when you come on home, you come back to a fresh bed. So usually Omar's side is like tucked in and mine since it's tucked off in the duck off, ain't nobody gonna see it anyways. And I like doing the final touch. You guys, we're requesting from our family new sheets for Christmas. Comforter. Comforter. Are you Comforter. the brown one in the back? Yeah. Brown one in the back. The brown one is not cute. Wow. It's just from my old wow. set. We're, we're still moving in together. You know what I mean? Wow. We've been living together for a whole year and a half. <laughs> Talking about we still moving in together. <laughs> and then we have the decorative pillows. Mind you, you guys, this is Omar's set. You already know. But his All sheets, though, is... are the softest sheets I've ever slept on. And this bed. I know it's a little too soft for you, but... Yeah, my back gets bright. My, my set was brown and his was gray. By the way, if there are any mattresses companies out there that want to partner with us, we're looking for a new mattress. This is a little too soft for Candace. It's a Tempur-Pedic. It's, it's absolutely my favorite. It's like sleeping on the cloud, but it just doesn't work for Candace anymore. Yeah, so my back gets hurt. So this is my pillow that I spent a lot of money on, so I put it anywhere. It's just because it's expensive and it feels good. It doesn't match, but hey. Now let's look. First off, Ghost needs to go take a little pee-pee. And the luxury of this home, randomly, <laughs> he not have that in shots, ugly. It's all my small little fan. Disrespect. The, the great part about this house is that we have a door. Mind you, we both used to live in apartments separately. So now that we live together, the best part of this house was this magic door that leads straight to the backyard. You mean the humble gym? Go! So our morning walks, going down the elevator, don't even happen anymore. He goes, he does his thing, he goes potty, and then he'll tell us when he's ready to come back in. But in the meantime, let's go brush our teeth. Hustle. And shout out to Intuitive for sending us these amazing portraits and pictures that we love. We have them all over the house. You already know what time it is. Come into the humble bathroom. 
That's the humble bathroom. We got a humble bathroom now. Humble gym, humble bathroom. We are humble. Oh my god, I'm so, so humble. humble. You guys, we have these new bonnets that are dropping on Black Friday. Cause sleepwear is very important, honey. I like to wear this kind of stuff to sleep because it literally saves my hair from having to redo it every single morning. Mm -hmm. He's known for wearing the do -ads. Let's oh, I gotta, just... I gotta keep braids, especially when I'm braided. I gotta keep the braids right, and I gotta keep my hairline fresh. Yeah. Lay, fam. And ever since I met him, he's been wearing do -ads, right? Mind you, he put me on to bonnets I, I about to three years ago, I and. My hair's grown, it stays moisturized, and like when my hair's straight for some reason, it stays straight when I wake up. And I don't know, it's just been a lifesaver. So we always wear them to bed now, and it, I would feel so bad to like not share that with you guys. And so we created our own bonnets and do rags for y'all. So make sure you guys check this out. Thecomorestore.com is gonna be there. It's up. But you guys, seriously, if you care about your hair and your edges, get them. And we have them in like five different colors. So you can match with your boo if you want to. Mm -hmm. Or if you don't. Yeah, if you don't, it's fine. Just get them. You can them buy on. multiple colors. Yeah. You get them all. Why not? I mean, hey, it's about um, stocking stuffing. You feel me? It's the holidays. It's the Season holidays. of giving. And we're giving you game because this Hello. is all good and all great Hello. for my hair. Let's um, brush them teeth. Okay, let's brush them. Oh my god, me this damn. Like a vibrator. Vibrating <coughs> stupid thing. Like a vibrator. And I like to do two <laughs> things at once. It's weird. You guys probably don't try this at home, but I. I find myself cleaning my ears at the same time and brushing my teeth because it saves time. But that's something I do on my own. Oh, that's a whole nother level of multitasking. Yeah, because I'm a woman and he's not. Yeah. And I could do that. Shout out to Kamala Harris. Shout out. To the new president of the United States. Vice president. I'm talking about the actual president. Oh, you're talking about Biden? I'm talking about Kamala. That's who I voted for. Anyways, it's none of your business. So, I usually put it like this and I'm gonna do it. Oh yeah, here's old school. I'm old school. Right, the toothbrush. Yeah. Even though he got me this, he doesn't even use it. Look, look at it. He, he too rough looks like a child. Like, what are you doing? What are you brushing, man? What are you brushing? Why do all his toothbrushes look like this? Look, look at it. <laughs> Laughing, y'all, but fellas. You good? Do you see this smile? You guys see this smile? He brushes like I brush the hell out of these teeth. Yeah, I'm like a freaking four-year-old. Let me show you guys a proper way to brush your teeth. See. Wash and dryer. Anyways, before I so rudely interrupted. See, Cass is brushing her teeth in a circular motion, right? The true proper way to brush your teeth is an up and down motion like so. I can't do it. You gotta get up in here like this. You know what I'm saying? Are you ready to get that crack? No! That didn't do it. That's how you ruin your toothbrush. Uh -uh. Oh. You gotta get in high too. I get that in high because a lot of y'all had that, that build up. Mm -mm. That shit be nasty. What did they, they tell you, babe? It was an insect shitting in your mouth. That's what it is, you didn't even know that. That's what the dentist told me what plaque was, just in general. Not my plaque, just oh, no. in general. If you got plaque, it's an insect shitting in your mouth. Yeah, that's true. Going boo boo in your mouth. Boo boo. It's, it's true. And I didn't do it at the same time, but y'all clean your ears in the morning, y'all. I'm not here to tell you what to do, but just do it, because it's good for you. Anyways, I like to have a lot of oils around, sitting around so that I don't forget. I'm very like, I have to. Things. Hold on, guys. Right. Brush your tongue. Yeah, brush your tongue. Brush your tongues, okay? He takes 30 minutes in the morning, so I don't know what he's doing in here. He's mm -hmm. brushing and taking a big old. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Gotta take that morning poo. Yeah. This is too much. Gotta start the day all right. You know like what I'm saying? Empty, empty yesterday's waste. Ah. Okay. Ah. Skincare. Hurry up, Omar. No, hold on. Wash your face, ladies. A little bit of water, a little bit of soap never did you wrong. You gotta wash the crust out your eyes. And with these nails, people ask me all the time, how do you maneuver with these nails? Honey, when you are a princess, you figure it out. Princesses wear nails and lashes and lashes. You know me, 
I don't know, what would you wash your face with? I soap and water. Ah, yeah, I'm just a cold water guy. I'm trying to have that skin like Pharrell. Yeah. Pharrell said you gotta wash your skin with cold water and exfoliate. I don't really exfoliate, but I'm washing that skin with cold water. My thing is um the after. My thing is like, I love having natural oils available for my face. I gave Omar some products that have CBD oil in it to like put after. He washes his face. God knows if he does that in the morning. Haven't used it yet. That's crazy. And I like to keep eucalyptus oil in around the shower. So like when I'm really feeling like at the end of the day I want to just really just breathe and relax I'd like to pour it I'm not supposed to do this but I pour it around the edges of the shower so that the steam comes up and hits my nostrils mm -hmm. really it. whenever I come out of the shower and it smells like my like, damn it's like a whole spa in here yeah I love this bath and I love this shower whatever oil works for you but that's this is what I use put on your deodorant oh yeah a little spritz spray. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moisturize. Whoops. Gotta moisturize. Coconut oil. I like using it. Um, oh. Guys, let's move on That's to the, the kitchen. Bathroom. Gotta eat. Gotta get that coffee. Gotta get that tea. I need that coffee. I need it. Ghost. And by this time, guys, Ghost is ready to come inside. He's already done his duties outside. <laughs> and he's over outside just wondering where okay. we are and why. Okay. We usually work on these little tricks once a day. Ghost, sit down. You can't come inside unless we approve it. Good boy, stay. Let's see if he listens today. He knows the cameras are on. You know, he acts a little different. He's a little booty dog. I'm Callie. His peepee's out. Don't mind his peepee. He's horny. He needs a girlfriend. Break! Good boy! Good morning! Welcome to the house! Good morning, man. Wow, no love. no love, no love, no love, no love. There it is, there is the love. Okay. I don't know if you guys know, but I'm on, I've been on this very special diet for the past three weeks and it's been doing really, really well. I could only have berries as my fruit of choice. So I usually do shakes in the morning, but I can't have bananas, I can't have pineapples, I can't have mangoes, all the fruits that I love. I can only have berries. So lately I've been making this killer shake in the morning with a little bit of sea moss. If you guys don't know what sea moss is, thank me later. And water and a little bit of orange juice. Yeah. It's been working for me. Now, Omar and his morning. I'm about to have me some nice little tea to get started. A little bit of water with some hot lemon. You feel me? Mechanic sliced coffee. Give me some. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah! God damn. That's what the coffee does. Jeez. That's what that coffee does. Jeez. When the coffee hits. <laughs> when the coffee hits. Woo! You gotta get you a coffee maker, fam. Y'all know what they call. Get you one, man. Hope you're not in there brewing pots. Press a button, fam. Sometimes, when he's being real sweet, he brings me some coffee in a bit. Y'all seen it on the stories. I just love it when he does that because it makes me feel like I'm the prettiest girl in the world. In the morning with my bonnet. Only He only does it when my bonnet's on. Only. He never does it when my hair wakes up without the bonnet and my hair is like, hmm. And it means she's not taking care of herself. Mm -hmm. Take care of yourself so I can take care of you. What a bar. Oh, trust me, I take care of myself. What a bar. See the way these hips moving? Woo! What a bar. Because Omar decided to eat them all this week. Six yesterday. So he Slam left me with absolutely nothing. Slam In my diet now, I can have cheese, I can have meat, and I can have like avocados and stuff. So I'm living my best life on this diet because I'm losing weight and I'm eating what I want. Ghost, this is not yours. It's mine. I'm gonna make myself. Thank you, babe. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make myself some sausage, avocado, and a little bit of no carb bread. Mm, can I have some of that? No. Damn. Yeah, wow. Because you're allowed to have carbs, so. So. The difference between women and men, you guys can eat whatever you want. The minute I'm eating something healthy, now you like what I'm eating and then you wanna have it. But it's just mine is like $16 for a slice of bread while yours is like $3. It doesn't even make any sense. Let me live my life. Have your regular bread. Thank you very much. If you hear me, let me hear you say yeah. Yeah. So since today is Saturday, we gotta give our plants some love. They get water once a week. We just gotta make sure that they stay hydrated, you know? Always hungry, never thirsty. Ain't that right, babe? That's right. See, we're first time plant owners, so. We don't know how to do it yet. We still learning. One of our plants almost died, to be honest. We had to move them to a different spot so she could get some natural light. 
Looks like she's doing a little bit better. Keep talking to her like that. <laughs> so and which plans do we have? That's a good question. <laughs> we just found some pretty know. ones, you know, at the store. We just bought it because we liked it. I had sent a picture to my mom and she was like, that one's great. I have two of those in my place. My favorite oil to use, and Omar put me onto this. Another one. Another one. Avocado oil. Just trust me, okay? I am not no chef. I am not nothing special in the kitchen, but. Yes, you are. You hear that crunch? How is it? Crunchy, seasoned to perfection. Wow. Okay, Delicious. Good. I'm gonna try it now. Wow. Carb free breakfast, my little berries and my little orange juice. Mm. I'm happy. Oh, great. I guess we don't need eggs. No, he's lying. We need an eggs. This is gonna work. And now, y'all gotta go. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications on so you get notified every time we post. Absolutely. And until next time, Comies. We out.